Hi, I am Lalit Vasist and you are watching Engineering Made Easy. In this video, we will learn how to solve this kind of circuits. We want to find here the output of this given circuit. The output is denoted by Y here. As you can see here that uh, this circuit is not very difficult. But the purpose of uh, solving this logic circuit is not to just solve it but to explain you how to approach this kind of circuits that have some kind of symmetry. For example, here you see we have three XNOR gates and these two XNOR gates at the input side are having symmetry. Okay, the same input A, B bar, A and B bar are applied to both of these XNOR gates. So if you do not observe the symmetry in the circuit, then you may solve this circuit by following the wrong approach like uh, a x nor b bar and a x nor b bar and again this x nor of these two here i have actually a simple uh, single uh, logic gate but suppose here we have a complex uh, logic circuit network and here also i have the symmetrical complex logic gates then the output of both of these will be same so first of all see if there is any kind of symmetry in the circuit then start to solve this because in many problems the main purpose is not just to solve the circuit from scratch but to observe the symmetry and you can solve the problem without using any pen paper so look at this the wrong approach for this would have been to simply XNOR these two inputs and obtain the two outputs and uh, use these two outputs as the input to this XNOR gate. But here, if you see any kind of symmetry, then you may simply write here that suppose the output here is X1 and since it is identical, same XNOR gate and same A and B bar inputs, so output will be x1 here so you see if i am applying same input okay to this uh, x nor gate then output is 1 because how i represent x nor if i have two inputs a and b so how do we represent the x nor in this way or also in this way it is a x nor b it is uh, complement to a x or okay so we write it as a into b plus a bar b bar okay and it's a truth table is if it is having two inputs as a and b then the output a x nor b would be 0 0 0 1 1 0 and 1 1 these are the four combinations then the output would be 1 if both of these inputs to the gate are same here the, these are 0 0 or 1 1 so output would be 1 and if the both inputs are opposite then its output would be 0 so you see here that uh, to this x nor gate same input is applied x1 x1 whatever be the logic gates at these places we are interested only in observing the symmetry so these two inputs are same and for two inputs having same value x1 and x1 so the output of x1 x1 would be 1 you see here same inputs having output 1 so output it is so is 1 so the value of y is 1 here so i hope you understood what i wanted to tell you what was the purpose of solving this uh, simple circuit just observe the symmetry and you can solve even very complex problems just by observing the circuit so hope you liked the video and the concept what i wanted to tell you for more such videos please don't forget to subscribe my channel engineering made easy and if you liked the video then please click on the like button and share it with your friends thank you for watching stay connected and see you soon in the next video. Bye. Friends, for more such videos, you can subscribe my channel, Engineering Made Easy. And please don't forget to like and share the video if you liked it. For more detailed information, you can visit my blog. See you soon in the next video. Till then, bye-bye.